My name is Mark Sanchez and I grew up in San Diego, California. As a matter of fact, directly across the street from the William J. Oaks Boys and Girls Club. Currently, I'm the superintendent president at Southwestern College and have worked in educational leadership for over 20 years. My name is Carlos Schmidt. I am a CPA by training. I have multiple connections to the Boys and Girls Club. I was a member growing up. I played on the basketball sponsored leagues. Um, I then had the opportunity in college to actually function like as a staff member for the Lakeside Boys and Girls Club. I served in the Keystone Club, I was a member of the Torch Club, and really traced my roots back to um, the influence that the Boys and Girls Club had in my life. What I always remember about the Boys and Girls Club was the amount of hope that it inspired in me. My teenage years were like the late 80s. One of the things that changed like in a lot of the neighborhoods was the existence of gangs, and it really, really plagued certain communities like in ways that up until that time it's hard to describe but you know because I played sports growing up I always knew that those institutions that supported them they were sending a message that they didn't want you to join a gang and that was always like present in my mind as do the right thing do the right thing do the right thing and I think that some of that origin certainly lies with the Boys and Girls Club. I feel like my role as a college president now is simply an extension of who I was as a young person and all of the things that were invested in me at the Boys and Girls Club. I think without the hope that I received from my involvement with the Boys and Girls Club, I just simply think that like, I would not have been able to escape the environment that I was in. The programs that are offered at these facilities are, are life-changing. You have to believe that I'm living proof. That's why the Boys and Girls Club and the experiences that I've had here are so, so important to who I am now. And it's very important for me to understand that and pay it forward back to the future generation of leaders in this community. No person alone, no company, no school, no Boys and Girls Club can do it without like the help of a lot of people. We have to take ownership of the situation and figure out like how we can give back and how we could do more. And I think giving to the Boys and Girls Club is a very good way of making a meaningful impact in the community and creating a positive outcome for a whole bunch of children.